गुड इवनिंग फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी विल डिस्कस ऑन द टॉपिक ऑफ फॉरेन इन्वेस्टमेंट फॉरेन इन्वेस्टमेंट इन दैट दैट इज एफ डी आई फॉरन डायरेक्ट इन्वेस्टमेंट फॉरन डायरेक्ट इन्वेस्टमेंट फॉरन डायरेक्ट इन्वेस्टमेंट today we will discuss the few facts about the foreign directment investment direct investments foreign investment means they are non debt creating capital transaction they are non debt creating capital transaction fdi the foreign investment is non debt capital creating transaction in this one of the that is foreign direct investment it refers to purchase of asset in the rest of the world which allows control over the asset over that asset example purchase of farms by the tata in the uk purchase of farms by the tata in the uk united kingdom on recommendation of mayaram panel a new definition of for fdi is adopted that is any foreign investment greater than equal to 10% stock in listed companies is treated as fdi what is that panel mayaram panel mayaram panel any foreign investment greater than the equal to greater than or equal to 10% of stock in listed companies some of the listed companies is treated as a you see here listed company the keyword is listed companies treated as fdi any investment in the unlisted entity also treated as fdi percentage it is defines whether an investment is fdi or the portfolio investment again the portfolio investment means two things come portfolio two things one is fii foreign institution investment institution other one is depository receipts depository receipts once in fdi is always fdi even if holding comes down less than 10% fdi is classified to brownfield buying on existing plant company or factory in order to launch new production activity greenfield investment such that to build the new factories in india the fdi can enter through automatic and non automatic roles means they can take lease or any company or they can invest on that directly means they can take the goods and they can purchase some way under automatic route means india auto they can enter automatic and non automatic entry nowadays it is a open door policy so many so many schemes coming under the fdi they are giving um, good sub scheme subsidies also other country under automatic route the foreign direct investment fdi simple i will call it fdi hello without approval of government and rbi and non automatic or the government route prior approval of government is required non automatic prior approval here yeah, the approval is not required automatic foreign investment promotion board which was responsible agency to oversee in non automatic route which was abolished in 2017 which one the foreign investment promotion board an indian company having received fdi foreign direct investment either under automatic or under government route government route means taking approval is required to comply with provisions of fdi policy including reporting of fdi and rbi foreign direct investment and rbi atomic energy and railway operations lottery companies chit fund companies housing and real estate 
ఎక్స్పెక్ట్ డెవలప్మెంట్ ఆఫ్ టౌన్షిప్ కన్స్ట్రక్షన్ ఆఫ్ రెసిడెన్షియల్ అండ్ కమర్షియల్ ప్రెమిసెస్ రోడ్ బ్రిడ్జ్ రియల్ ఎస్టేట్ ఇన్వెస్ట్మెంట్ ట్రస్ట్ అండర్ సెబీ రెగ్యులేషన్ మ్యానుఫ్యాక్చరింగ్ ఆఫ్ టొబాకో ప్రొడక్ట్స్ ఆల్సో సి అగైన్ ఐఎమ్ టెల్లింగ్ రైల్వే ఆపరేషన్స్ లాటరీ కంపెనీస్ చిట్ ఫండ్ కంపెనీస్ హౌసింగ్ రియల్ ఎస్టేట్ రోడ్ అండ్ బ్రిడ్జెస్ రియల్ ఎస్టేట్ ఇన్వెస్ట్మెంట్ ట్రస్ట్ అండర్ సెబీ రెగ్యులేషన్ సెబీ మీన్స్ సెక్యూరిటీ ఎక్స్చేంజ్ బోర్డ్ ఆఫ్ ఇండియా దీస్ ఆర్ ద ఫ్యూ ఫ్యాక్ట్స్ అబౌట్ ఫారెన్ డైరెక్ట్ ఇన్వెస్ట్మెంట్ ఫార్ దట్ ఈస్ ఫారె